Hello Queens and welcome back. It's Queen of Queen She Me and today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my May and June Sephora Play Box. Um, I did not get the chance to unfortunately unbox my May one. May was crazy at the end of the month. So I'm just going to unbox it here with the one for June since I just got it in the mail today. Um, if you guys are wondering what I'm sipping on, I'm sipping on some women's wellness tea. And I picked this up online at let'sbevegan.com. Her name is Chantel. You can find her on Instagram at bevegan underscore. And you guys, this is a 100% organic blend of tea. Right now, I just steeped it for like 10-15 minutes. But usually, I drink it as an infusion where you steep it overnight for about 24 hours. So yeah, so that's what I'm having. So... Let's get right on ahead and get into the Sephora Play unboxing. So this is the May um, Play Sephora box. And what's called Play by Sephora, you guys. And I'll leave the link listed down below so that way if you want to subscribe, you can. I have previous unboxings as well, so definitely check the description box. And I'll link them throughout the video in a little card up top. So this one's from May. This one says, love love tips, love tips, tricks, and beauty hacks. Sephora.com backslash play. And so I've already used my actual um, Sephora card where you get 50 points for every time that you actually purchase a Sephora play box. And so I actually used that when I went to the Sephora VIB Rouge fall sneak peek preview um, premiere, whatever event that they had like, yeah, they had it last no saturday before last i believe and you guys are oh my gosh i spent too much money as always and he yeah, is so um and i use my card there so that way like you know i can get like some goodies on my sephora points so that's always a plus when you're actually getting the sephora play box so for me it was the rising stars um seven things you didn't know you can do at sephora and so you can bring a friend and i love these because they tell you just like everything that you can do at sephora like with your play box and you can like also go in the store try out the products that you actually have purchased here as a sample size and you can like go in and actually like get a makeup consultation you guys so just depending on your level there and so you can do like a whole bunch of things at sephora so i'm not ooh. So I already see some products that I'm familiar with for the month of May. So this is the package that it came in. And I love the packages that they send the samples in. And like these are like the deluxe size samples. And so it's only $10 a month. And so it just says play all over the packaging as you guys can see. And so I'm just going to jump right into it and see what's in here. Because I've been waiting to use it. <laughs> so the first thing I picked up is the Toka or Toka, Toka, I guess that's how you pronounce this, T-O-C-C-A. And this is their perfume, this is in Stella. So this is the Toka perfume in Stella. And I'm just actually gonna like mist this and see what it smells like. I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure it's like a um, summertime scent. I wonder what the notes are. Yeah, blood orange, spicy lily flirt with white freesia, freesia and sensual sandalwood oh and i like how sandalwood smells so let me see here let's just try this out oh yeah i like that <coughs> yeah i'm a toilet kind of girl i'm not really like a perfume kind of girl but yeah that smells pretty good Oh yeah, that smells bomb. Oh yeah, this smells bomb. Ooh. Oh yes, that's sexy. Okay, I smell it now. Ooh, I had to spray it again and fan it. Ooh, I love this. So this is from Toka. And then and again, this is their Stella perfume. Okay, next we have a hair mask. Ooh, I love samples like this because you guys know I'm a natural kind of girl. And like I got these little jewels going on, and like it just it just matches everything. So this is from Rahua. It's an Omega 9 hair mask. It's a 100 plant derived rainforest grown hair mask. And it's cool and you just use it after shampooing. You apply it generously all over and then you leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes and then you rinse. So y'all, this is so dope. I would like definitely use this like as a rinse out conditioner. So like say if I'm in the shower, I would definitely give this a go. Oh my gosh, I don't know if y'all can hear that, but that rain is beating down. It's gonna be rain, it's gonna be raining like that for like the next week and a half or so. 
oh my gosh you guys this is so this smells oh this smells just like a perfume like it is so it's not so strong but it is a strong fragrance it definitely smells like a perfume so i would definitely definitely use this as a rinse out mask but it's a white um it has a white color and it's very thick too from what i could see so again this is the rahua omega 9 hair mask Next, I received their Belief, Believe in Truth Hungarian Water Essence. Ooh, ooh. Okay, you guys, I have just recently gotten to Facial Essence, and they're pretty much like a toner, but I think they help you with, like, fine lines and wrinkles. I've been seeing a lot of, like, the big time, well, not big, I've just been seeing a lot of the makeup artists, you know, and a lot of people who are, like, really into skincare talking about skin essences right now. And so, like, I've been using one from Ski2, and, like, I got that in a small sample size from actually my, um, I actually used them for my Sephora VIB points. So, that's how I actually got two deluxe size samples of those. So, I've been using it for, like, almost two weeks now, and I actually do like how it makes my skin very soft. I can see, like, I don't really see, like, a lot of, um like a lot of my um, pores or anything like that. So this is an aqua based formulation and it's an increased hydration level. So yeah, so like this is from Belief and you guys know I love their aqua bomb and I also like the other one that they have but I prefer the aqua bomb one because the other one's just too hydrating for my um, oily skin. So I'm just fixing to go ahead and pump this out like right now while I have it here. So you guys can see, so. I don't, oh, that's all I want to use. Oh, yeah. Oh, and it smells just like the Aqua Bomb. I love lines when they're consistent across the board. And I like the fact that this is like one where it's like very hydrating because it is 98% aqua based formulation so oh my gosh now i've found i know this cannot be expensive so i'm definitely going to check this out and see how much it costs online at sephora but look at that look how it just just kind of just sunk into the skin it feels so good it's hydrating and my skin feels very soft too as well you guys my nails gone <laughs> but it's very soft as well so I love that. I love that. So I'm so happy I got this from Belief because I love Belief's products anyway. So the next product that I got is actually a lip, a lip pencil and it's by Tristique. And I've never heard of this brand or maybe it's a highlight. Okay. It's a mini highlight stick. So you guys know I love highlighters and it doesn't say what shade it's in. I wonder if the pamphlet, the pamphlet probably does, but I'll link it down below like I always do. So I'm just going to go ahead and swatch it right here. Ooh. Yeah, that's a little fair for my skin. Like, I probably wouldn't. I hope you guys can see that on camera. But I probably, I may use that on me. But it kind of pulls up like a little ashy. So I would probably use this like an eyeshadow base or something like that. But that would be cute to use because, like, you can use your um, makeup products for like different uses, so that's cool. Oh, so it's another one from a brand that I already know and love. This is the Tatcha Pure One Step Camellia Cleansing Oil. And you guys, I wanted to try this when it first premiered. I think it premiered earlier this year or last year in December. Sometime like that. But it's been out for a while now. And so I've been wanting to try this. And oh my gosh, a lot of people like it. Some people like it. But then some people don't. It all depends, again, on your preference because some people aren't into um, cleansing oils. And me, personally, I've never used one, but I've used um, makeup oil-based removers where I use makeup removers where they're oil-based so that way I can, like, remove my makeup from my face. And so I just use that and it would just pretty much just break down all my makeup. So I've never actually used this just, like, to cleanse my face. So I don't know how my skin would feel about that, but... Of course, I'm going to have to smell it, and I love how the products smell. And once I open this, of course, I'm going to have to use it, which is not a problem. Ugh, it smells so good. 
It has a very soft scent. All of the products do actually. And I love their um, enzyme powder, the one that's in the purple packaging. And like a little bit goes a long way. I've had that one for a while. So again, this is from Tatcha. And this is the Pure One Step Camellia Cleansing Oil. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to use this tonight. So I'll definitely go ahead and probably leave a description or a little review right here for you guys. Because I love, I love, love Tatcha. Okay, so the last one for my, um, <laughs> so the last item that I got in my May Play by Sephora box, um, is the, what is this? Okay, so this is the nude magnetic matte look color, and so this is what it looks like. And so I'm just going to swatch it here for you guys, so that way you can actually see what it looks like. I'm just going to swatch it. Ooh, my God, that is creamy. Oh, I love, oh, I love, oh, let me stop, let me stop. Y'all, look at that. I love the lip colors. And you guys, I really haven't been wearing any of my lipsticks lately. I don't know why, like, my lips have been very dry lately, and I cannot figure out why in the hell I cannot keep them moisturized. I use so much lip conditionings and, like, ointments, and nothing's working. So, like, but this is so freaking creamy. Like, this is creamy, and it says it dries matte, so... We're going to see because I'm going to continue on. And so we're going to continue on. And so now we're going to actually go into the June 2017 Sephora Play by Sephora. So this box. is the Play by Sephora June box. And so I'm just going to go ahead and open it here on camera with you guys. Because again, I have not opened this. <laughs> I have not opened this at all. I just came straight home and I went to my mailbox and I was like, yes. All right, you guys, so this is the June Play by Sephora Play Box. And this one says Love Tips, Tricks, and Beauty Hacks. And so this one's for June 2017, your summer starters. And so as I was telling you guys in the May 2017 um, Play Box, that it comes with a card, as you guys see on here. And so I have another 50 points to spend. And this is going to be so much fun once I actually go back to Sephora. Cause you guys like i just like to honestly go to sephora for like my skincare products like i have just been lately really obsessed with doing that and like now with actually watching what i'm eating it's really been helping a lot like i have some breakouts still but like they're nowhere near how they used to be back in the day so this is what the bag looks like for june and this is let me see it says in a summer state of mind and as you can see, it has some girls in their bathing suits and they're swimming. And ooh, I already see something in the back that I already know. So let's go on ahead and open this one up. So yeah, grab it right on in there. And so I'm familiar with this. This is the YSL Black Opium um, Perfume. And it is a natural spray. And so it is in here. I'm familiar with it. I actually smelled this when we were at the um fall preview event at sephora and it really is not a bad scent it really smells nice yeah it smells very 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 nice let me see if it has any of the notes on here okay it's black coffee accord orange blossom and cedar wood and it also has patchouli so i like that because i like the orange blossom because it's an artillery cologne that i like and i can't i forgot the second the last name of it but it's a cologne that is at sephora and i love it because it has an orange citrus scent to it and then i like cedar wood and patchouli already and then black coffee of course first of all i love coffee i just haven't been drinking it a lot so yeah this is perfect this is right up my alley so black opium you guys it smells really 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 good it smells really really good so that's a nice size sample because like if you don't wear perfume all the time if you're like me you like to rotate them out you're gonna be good for a minute all right so the next item i see is by igk and i just finally i just recently um find out found out about this brand and it was actually through instagram because you guys know you can find me on instagram facebook and twitter and you can also definitely find me here on youtube that's why you're watching me and yeah so this is the rich kid coconut oil gel you guys know i really do not do hair gels but something like this if it's coconut oil gel maybe it would really work nice on my hair It doesn't really have a scent to it, but it is a white color and it is like an um, gel-like consistency. But this is what the packaging looks like. 
so I don't know maybe I'll use this maybe I will not but again you guys know I really do not use gels quite often so yeah oh 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 damn come through Sephora hey okay so this is the oil uh, and I always said the name wrong but it's oi oye oh my gosh it's the oua eye company brand y'all know what this is if you guys like skincare y'all know what this is y'all know what this is i do not know how to pronounce this but this is the rose hair and body oil and oh my gosh oh my gosh you guys it smells so freaking good so again, this is the um, what oil oye. I think that's how you pronounce it. Oye hair care. It's a rose hair and body oil. And oh my gosh, this is a 0 0.2 fluid ounce container. And yeah, I cannot really read that small writing. So I guess you would just simply apply this on your hair and on your body, however you would want. And like I would probably want to put this on my body. But I don't know. It smells so good. I will use it for my body and my hair. Like, that's bomb. Like, that's bomb. Like, I'm going to see how much this is, y'all. That smells good. And I've never tried anything from them, but it's a brand I've always wanted to try. So, moving on. This is the Pore Professional by Benefit. And this is, of course, a primer. I already have, I think, like, two of them already on my vanity. So, I'm familiar with this. I think this is, like, a coconut base product no it's not it's um it's um well yeah well they do have one that's a coconut base and that's the one that i have and that one makes my oil skinny so i wonder if this one's gonna make me mad because this one says to minimize the appearance of pores but the other one does too but it says actually also to hydrate the skin so i want to give this one a go so yeah this is by pore profession i mean this is the Pore Professional Primer from Benefit Cosmetics. And I, oh, oh my gosh. Okay. So I'm already freaking out about it. We got a Kat Von D lippy. A lippy. Look at that. We got a lippy. I, I, Y'all, I have not used anything from Kat Von D. Nothing. 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 And I wanted to actually try her foundation this summer. Because a lot of people say that it's actually good for the summertime. So, like, I need another summer, I need another summertime foundation. I also use the one that is from Sephora. It's like 20 bucks. It's really nice. But I just wanted to try a different one. So, it does have a dull foot applicator. And so, I'm just going to, oh, y'all, like, that is such an electric purple. Like, that is no game. That's like, bam, bitch. I'm in your face. Like, I love that color. I like that. It's like summertime too. So like, you know, summertime you want to wear bright colors, pop, have fun. So like, yeah, that's dope. I love the color. I love the color. It's like, it's like very, very, very bright. Oh, I didn't even tell you guys the shade. <laughs> the Kat Von D shade is called K-Dub. That is the name of the shade. So yeah, so I got that too. So like, that's bomb. Last but not least from First A Beauty, I've actually used their actual facial mist and I love that stuff. It really does make your face hydrated. I love it. Even though I have oily skin, it can still get dry. So like I still like carry like a facial mist in my bag. So this is the Coconut Skin Smoothing Priming Moisturizer. Mmm. A smoothing priming moisturizer. I like that. I like that. So that's from um, First A Beauty. If you guys aren't familiar with First Aid Beauty, they're like one of the other brands that's in Sephora that is really like not expensive. Like I really must say First Aid Beauty, like I bought some of their stuff and it's not expensive. It's really nice. So this is what the, um, this is what it looks like. I just got a little dab on my hand. It's like a beige color. And just rub that in. Oh, a little goes a long way. Like that's a lot. Like look at all that primer. Let me see what it smells like. Oh, it smells good. It really doesn't have like a strong fragrance, but it really does smell good. Oh, that smells really nice. As you can see, it just really like, you know, my skin's really absorbed it. Well, I mean, you can still see it, but I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah, so that feels really, really nice. 
So you guys, that pretty much concludes everything that I actually got in my May and June Sephora play box. You guys, I love the subscription. Again, it's only $10 a month and then after tax like $10.75. So like that's not bad. You can cancel it anytime that you want. Again, you can go to their website. I will have the link listed down below so that we can go down and read all the terms and conditions and you can decide if you want to sign up or not. Me personally, I love them. This keeps me from having to go in there and spend a lot of money versus I can just spend $10, get the luxe size samples of products that I want to try or if I'm familiar with, and I'm satisfied just that way, you guys. So I love it. I hope you guys try it out. If you've already signed up, let me know down below in the comment section. And again, I also will list down below my previous unboxings from my other play boxes for you guys. Thank you so much, queens, for hanging out with me today. And I love each and every one of you. Be blessed, you guys. Mwah!